this guy. He's just lurking. He looked kind of funny. It's like an eel fish thing. Like
feels weird to give them my card. Standing out a window. We are snowboarding and can confirm I am terrible. Also, my hair is in my freaking face. So annoying. But yeah, the boys are, are coming down in a second. But I'm just chilling here right now. I don't know where they are, but there's a bunch of people here right now. I'm already out of breath. I gotta take off this other boot. So guys, it's uh, it's Saturday morning, and um, I left my hotel like an hour and a half ago, and I'm still in Canada. And it was only supposed to take me an hour to get to the border, and I was supposed to already be in the U.S. And I got my car out of the, the parking lot, and I got my ticket, and it didn't accept it but it opened the gate for me so i left and then i felt really bad i didn't want to get a ticket in the mail or something because i'm not from here and like i can't fight it so i went back to try and pay it and the machine was broken so it just kept spitting back my ticket so then i ended up just leaving so then i was like 30 minutes late and now i'm sitting in traffic that's like barely moving on the highway in hamilton and i'm like Really, I'm like 30, 40 minutes away from Toronto, and I'm still like 30 minutes to 40 minutes away from the border. And we're just literally stop and go like very slow traffic. I've already been here for like 30 minutes, and I was like, I could just say, I could talk to my vlog for a bit. So, yeah, we've been here for 30 minutes. Um, the, the, the crash or whatever is, is supposed to be like 0.9 miles away. And then hopefully it opens up and we can get back. Um, but it says I'm not going to be back till 7 o'clock now. It's 6 o'clock about 30 minutes ago. So not looking great. So, yeah. <laughs> So it ended up just being some road work, but there was an accident behind us too. Like right there, there's a truck and a car. But yeah, they cut off the entire highway and, and this is what's happening. So rip. We are free of that area and we're back to some open road here to the border. So let's go. It's uh, It says we're only delayed 30 minutes from our original time now, which is terrible. Just kidding, there was no entrance ramp to the highway, so um, we're back into the same boat of like getting off and getting back on. And I went a little bit more into the neighborhood and followed everybody else, but it's not doing any better. So, so yeah, not, not, not it, man. I'm like, well, like there's, they were doing, redoing the highway or some shit, but there's nobody even working on it. So they blocked off this highway, like the only thing out here because there's, not a whole lot in Hamilton area, and or we're in like Grim Grimsby, Gr the Great Gatsby or whatever. Like there's nothing out here, and they close out the one highway at nine o'clock in the morning, for I don't know why, and it's just fucked. Honestly, it's just fucked. I don't know. Like New York does some dumb shit like this too. I should have just stayed over there to make my life easier, but I thought that this would this maneuver would get me there quicker but it definitely isn't because they're moving a little bit over there but we're moving really slow over here so i'm just pissed right now and it says i'm gonna be an hour and a half late right now so i'm hoping things get better and i've also like you see my lip i like bit this shit out of it i don't know why all right well hopefully we're gonna be free up soon Okay, now for real this time, we're clear, we're getting on the empty highway, and we're back on schedule. Not really, we're, we're 
we're still hours behind now, but it's okay. We're, we're gonna get there. All right, we just crossed the border back into the U.S. We're in Buffalo, my old my old college town, and we got stuck behind the border for a while. I'll go over that in a second. So these people in front of me, I guess, were from like Ontario somewhere, and they were trying to get in. They had like a full car of people, and of course, in front of me, every other line was fine. But they took like 15 minutes. So I was waiting there for 15 minutes, waiting for them to get flagged. And then they had to get checked out, so like they got pulled to the side to get looked at, and they're still there, but they let me like pull up. And then the officer like mumbled to me, he's like, are you something something citizenship? And I was like, I'm sorry, what? And then I got a little nervous because I didn't want to like fuck up, and I was like, I live in America. <laughs> and he's like, are you a citizen? I said, yes. And I don't know why, it was just like not a normal conversation because he's like, I think he asked if I was like where I was a citizen of, but he just asked it really weirdly and like kind of mumbled it. So I was a little confused, but we're, we're good. We're, we're in Buffalo, we're about to pass the Key Bank Center and we should be home soon. Guys, I was gonna record this sick maneuver I just had. So I'm in upstate New York, like in the middle of like bumfuck. And there was like four cars going like 40 miles an hour in like the, the 55 on like the only single road highway. So we snaked all four of them, got up to like, not gonna say, I don't wanna get in trouble on, on YouTube or something. They're gonna be like, oh, we have proof of you saying you're doing illegal things on the internet. Well, yeah, fuck you. All right. Um, yeah, so we snaked all four and they were going so slow and, and now I'm stuck behind somebody else who's going 39. But we're in, we're in like a town area, so it's reasonable. But like, I got six hours left. Like, I'm, I'm not trying to take my time here, like, just leisurely around town. Like, I got nothing else to do, like all these people. So we're kind of skiing around a bunch of people right now. And yeah, I was gonna record it, but then I, you know, it seemed kind of scumbaggy. So I just figured I'd tell you about it now.